What is your ideal prop firm? How about a firm that gives you the same powerful tools that professional institutional bank traders use? Now picture that same firm being powered by a globally regulated broker with a solid reputation offering seamless trading on both TradingView and MT5. Best of all, they accept US traders, provide this at the same cost and trading rules as most other prop firms. They also let you trade news. You can use EAs, hold positions over the weekend, and refund your challenge fees when you withdraw on your first profits. Sounds too good to be true? Well, that's exactly what Think Capital brings to the table. As most of you know, I love trading fundamentals. I love trading news, and I use TradingView. So what I really like about Think Capital is they bring all of that together in their advanced trading tools. That's why in this video, I want to introduce you to Think Capital, and we'll go Going to take a look at some of the cool tools that I like the most. But Think Capital is powered by Think Markets, a multi regulated broker known for their cutting edge technology and some of the best trading execution in the industry. Think Markets has been around since 2012, with offices in major financial hubs like Chicago, London, Dubai, Tokyo, Melbourne, and Johannesburg. They have a long history and a global presence with experienced management. So let's go ahead and take a look at their platform. So what you're looking at right now is the Think um, Capital accounts. The first thing you get when you log in is your watch list. And so what you need to do is you need to start to build your watch list and add in the instruments that you trade. So for example, you know, I think the best way is we put in the dollar and we add all of the dollar based instruments that are most commonly traded. And you can build your watch list there. You can add in every single instrument that you choose that you want to trade. So we've added in a number of instruments and on the right hand side is your standard trading view chart. So you can trade here, you can hit your dollar sell and you can put the amount that you wanna trade. You can automatically add your stops and limits. What's really cool is that it remembers your stops and limits that you commonly use. You don't need to type them in every single time and it actually helps you trade a lot faster. So, you know, you can add in all the typical indicators and you can add, you can compare symbols and you can do a lot of pretty advanced features using just their TradingView platform alone. What I really like about it is their trading calendar. And that's the part that I think is really, really cool and very, very valuable. So with their trading calendar, what they show, and I use this to trade non-farm payrolls and you can sort this by just the high events, but what they do is they show you how the different instruments, different currencies have moved around the big events. So here I've sorted non-farm payrolls. You can add this to your own calendar. But what I like is this volatility. With the volatility, you can see exactly how your dollar moved off of non-farm payrolls five minutes after the event. So in October, your dollar moved 65 pips five minutes after the event. And then you can ask yourself, was there continuation after that? So with your dollar, there was 10 pips of continuation from 60 something to 70 pips. What about four hours later? Not much continuation. But how did this work for dollar and yen? So if you look at that and you see dollar and yen, let's start off five minutes after the release, we had 175 pip move. One hour after the release, that was 216 pips move. So additional 40 pips. And then four hours after the bet, that was 240 pips, give or take. So this was 175, basically. So that would be another 65 pip move. So if I'm looking to treat NFPs, for example, I, you know, will look at this and I will say, okay, you know, they're usually with your dollar, if I'm trading your dollar, it looks like the bulk of the move happens in the first five minutes and there may not be much continuation. But if I'm looking to wait for the move data to come out and then ride the continuation move afterwards, then dollar and yen could be better trade. Another good way to use this calendar is we know non farm payrolls was important. We know US inflation report is important, but how important and you know, which one is more important? So we can see that with dollar yen, we had a higher 75 pip move and a 985 pip move after the non-farm payrolls report. What about the US inflation report? Well, here's the US inflation report. Let's look at volatility. You can see that five minutes after the last one, we only have 46 pip move and 50 pip move. So this tells me that inflation, even though theoretically is very important for the Federal Reserve, is actually less market moving for dollar yen than the non-farm payrolls report. So this is the type of institutional quality tools that I think is very valuable for traders, particularly the ones, you know, who trade news and also trade fundamentals like me. You can get other information, like it shows you this in a chart perspective, which is really, really neat, I think. It tells you how show how much it's moved. You can also see how, you know, the data has changed. You get the actual forecast, things like that. 
The other thing I forgot to mention is back on the watch list. If you click on a currency pair and you click up over here on the right hand side, you get all the news, the important news you should know for the currency pair. What's been going on, the calendar, what the FX newswire is, key levels, some commentary that's related to the pair. So Dolly Cad has less information and you can read, you know, the, the main things you should know. So when you start your day, you can look at that and see if you missed anything overnight. They also have trading signals. I'm not sure where the trading signals come from. It's definitely technical based trading signals, but you can look at it, see if it's consistent with your ideas. See if a currency pair is moving very quickly upwards or S&P is at all-time high. What's the next level of support and resistance? You may not know. And Think Markets, you know, has a whole analyst team that helps you figure that out. And they list this in the key price levels. In Markets, it just shows you what the other markets are doing, gives you some news, some top signals. The Traders Gym is basically their back testing simulation tool. So you can put in your own trading strategies and they can help you look at past performance and see how it moved based upon in different strategies and your positions that you might put on. You could do different simulations for your trades. And then they have a video library about how to use Think Capital and some, you know, key market terms explains and other things that you know they think you should know before placing your first trade so you can use all of this this is available so i'd like to use the trading view version you can also use the mt5 version and if you just want to start your day and check all these different things check the economic calendar check the news and then trade on your regular trading view platform where you have your customized indicators and your customized layouts you can do that afterwards as well and then connect your Think Capital account with your current TradingView account and trade directly on your current TradingView platform. So there's so much flexibility and it's a really user-friendly platform. And that's why I think it really it kind of stands apart and stands above from all of the other prop trading platforms that are out there. These cutting edge tools are included in every Think Capital evaluation account. So Think Capital has three types of evaluation accounts. Lightning, which is a one step, dual step, which is their two phase and Nexus, which is their three phase. Now, two step evaluations are the most popular for most prop firms out there. For 50,000 accounts at Think Capital, their phase one profit target is 8% and their phase two profit target is 5% with a default 80% profit split, which is pretty much industry standard. Their daily loss is a limit of 4% and their max loss is 8%. So on a 50K dual step challenge, that costs 299 US dollars, which compares to 340 euros at a company like FTMO, which is basically about $380. Now, FTMO offers slightly better 10% max daily drawdown and a 5% daily loss, but Think Capital offers highly customizable trading conditions. Traders can enhance their trading experiences with optional add-ons, including increased profit splits, additional drawdown limits to what FTMO offers, and more frequent payout options at the same or slightly lower costs. This flexibility allows traders to tailor the trading environments to their specific requirements and needs, maximizing their potential for success. So for example, if you add the 10% max daily drawdown and the 5% daily loss to your Think Capital evaluation, the fee is $373.75, which is basically the same cost and that's just slightly cheaper than a company like FTMO. That's only if you feel that you need a wider max and daily loss. If you don't, you can opt to spend that money on weekly payouts, 90% profit share, EAs, or news trading. If you feel like you need none of that, then the fee is about a good percentage cheaper than FTMO. It's completely up to you and your trading style. So with hundreds of prop firms out there, only a select few are truly reputable. My personal preference has always been prop firms affiliated or powered by established brokers. And the reason is simple. These brokers have far more at stake. They'll be much more cautious about doing anything that could tarnish their reputation, even if the prop firm operates separately from the broker's regulated entity. So ask yourself, would you rather trade with a fly-by-night firm run Run by someone with limited experience or with an established globally recognized brand on the same terms at pretty much the same cost with some added benefits of enhanced trading tools. The prop trading industry is growing and now you have better choices. So the choice, in my opinion, is clear. You can either trade your valuation with a new prop firm using scrap together technology or you can trade both your valuation and eventually your funds account with a prop firm backed by a major broker, giving you access to their professional grade tools. I think the choice is obvious. 
There's more information and added benefits of Think Capital in the description below. And you know, of all the prop firms that I've looked at, I think that Think Capital truly stands out. The terms are same as most other prop firms, but you also get this broker powered platform and their tools. And what I love, at least for me, is that US traders can trade directly on TradingView. And you know, you can do that if you're abroad or you can trade through NT5, it's your choice. So that's really a huge benefit. And if you prefer to be on the TradingView platform, you can just connect to TradingView platform and continue to use that with all of the settings and tools that you already have downloaded. There's no consistency rules. And as I said earlier, you will get your challenge fee refunded if you pass your challenge and you withdraw your first profit. So for all of these reasons, Think Capital should be on the top of your list of prop firms to trade with. There are more details in the description below, including a discount code and some other added BK benefits.